Hi everyone, this is Mohamed Alfan, welcome to Rosen Columns. In this session, I am going to show you how to compare two set of worksheet and identify indifference value by using condition formatting. Maximum two minutes, within that you will get it how it works. Anyway, all the best. In this workbook, you can see that there's a two Excel sheet, right? January 21st and February 21st. So what I want to do is I just want to cover this two set of data and identify the differences and get highlighted in different colors. For that purpose, we need to use condition formatting. Before getting into condition formatting, let's go through the both sheet data randomly. For example, very first item, transmission quantity is showing 130, but February 21st is showing 130. It's same, right? There's no differences at all. January 21st, battery showing triple one, but in this case is 110. Again, this case is muffler showing 127, but February 21st is showing 126. So those different items has to get highlighted here. In this case, since items are really less, we can do manually, right? Suppose if you have a large set of data, more than 1000 and 4000 line items, it's very difficult to do one by one manually. That's case we are using condition formatting option. Let's see how it's going to work. First, I'm going to select complete set of data under January 21st. After that, go to home. And here you can see under style group condition formatting rubber, click on this and go to new rule. As soon as you click on this, a new formatting rule dialog box will appear, right? You can see here multiple options. Under this, just opt with the last option, use a formula to determine which cell to format. Here I'm just going to apply the formula. So in this field, I'm just placing cursor equal to, and I'm just going to select the first cell as references, A1. As soon as I selecting A1, you can see there are two dollar signs appeared, right? So that means this dollar signs makes cell references absolute. That means it's get locked. So I just want to remove this dollar sign. For that, just press F4 three times on your keyboard. Now you can see dollar sign has been disappeared, right? After that, insert not equal to sign and go to February tab. Select again same cell reference A1. Here also I'm going to remove the dollar sign and just pressing three times F4. So here is the formula. That means by comparing these two sheets, any value not equal to should get highlighted in different color. So here what I did, I just apply the formula. Here I'm just going to choose the respective format or color. So here you can see format options, click on it and opt in green color and OK and OK it. Now you can see that respective value has been highlighted in different color, which are not equal to data under February 21st, right? Hope all of you clear. Thanks for watching it. Thank you.